The biggest event of the year is right around the corner, the Super Bowl. But who really cares about that when the great thing is, Taylor Swift is showing up to the Super Bowl. And while I'm not a huge fan of this artist, there are many people out there that legitimately have started to grow a true yucky taste in their mouth for her. There's even been people saying she's ruining football. And as a football channel, I decided to see how a country star turned pop star could honestly be ruining an entire sport. The first thing you'll notice about the relationship between Taylor Swift and not Travis Kelsey, but the NFL is how much the NFL is always panning their cameras right on Swifty, making sure they always have a dedicated cameraman just in case she breaks out a little jazz or something. But it's even after every touchdown, they don't really show the players or cheerleaders that much. They just pan to Taylor Swift to see her celebrating with Patrick Mahomes' wife. Taylor is in the house. Any opportunity they have, they'll be showing Taylor Swift. Again? You get my point. It's a lot of Taylor Swift. And to be honest, she isn't doing much to help out Travis Kelsey on the sidelines. And while I'm sure she's supportive, I don't think the extra effort is why the Chiefs are scoring and why Travis Kelsey is such a good tight end. So why would the NFL be showing such a popular artist repeatedly, even when Travis Kelsey and Jason Kelsey seemingly agreed that yeah, the NFL was overdoing it a little bit for Taylor Swift. Luckily for us, Jason Kelsey has the perfect answer for why the NFL is doing this. Just wants to see it. I mean, if, it, if people didn't want to see it, they wouldn't be showing it. I know that. So I think, uh, you know, she's a world star. Um, uh, uh, she's the, the, the quintessential, you know, artist right now in the world. Singer, songwriter, immensely talented. Jason Kelsey then went on to talk about how Taylor Swift is also such a great role model and that was great for the NFL's brand. But what I really want to focus on here is how she's the quintessential pop star. She's one of the most famous people across the entire globe. And with fame comes money. And the NFL loves the money. And Tay Swizz might be the biggest free cash cow the NFL has ever ran into. She alone has generated over $330 million for the Chiefs and the NFL. Most players across their entire years could only hope to generate that much wealth. There's even people showing up at these games just to get a glimpse of Taylor Swift and will of course support Taylor Swift's boyfriend. Meaning while the efforts of players are commendable, by showing Taylor Swift celebrating rather than players or cheerleaders, you get some of that sweet nectar of the gods, brand value. Now hypothetically speaking, what would be better than Taylor Swift storming on the field after the Super Bowl, the NFL's biggest event, to only have Travis Kelsey propose to her? This would be far and wide the most watched event probably of the decade. You'd see people on the corners selling tapes of the game. And this is the theory I've been gifted in my comment section. The game is rigged. And while I personally don't subscribe to this theory, it's one that makes sense for a money grab. If you're able to generate as much eyeballs to watch an event and the NFL is a sports entertainment company, then it goes hand in hand why you would want to rig this game. But I don't think the NFL is in the business of rigging games. Rather, I do think the NFL is going to be showing Taylor Swift time and time again to try to milk every last drop they can out of this NFL season with Taylor Swift. And can you blame them? The NFL has received an extra value from Taylor Swift just showing up of $330 million. That's wild for someone that never has to play it down to football. So while everyone wants to make this about Taylor Swift ruining the NFL, the fact is the NFL is the one with the cameras and the one constantly trying to highlight Taylor Swift is at the game. And going into the Super Bowl, while I would like to say that NFL is going to change their ways and stop showing Taylor Swift as much and focus on the X's and O's of football. The fact is, that's not going to be the case. We're going to be hearing about Taylor Swift's new song, maybe maybe their wedding after the game. Who knows? But one thing's for sure, the NFL is going to be showing plenty of Taylor Swift, and they're going to let that cash cow continue to produce. But these are just my thoughts on the Taylor Swift situation that I think's gone out of hand. While she's showing up at the games, I don't think it's her fault for being shown. I just think the NFL loves the money she's generating. And if they do have the opportunity to make more money, 
they're going to do that. And we've seen that from the NFL. They'll add an extra game in the season. It's a money-making business. Anyways, now that I've given my thoughts and how the NFL isn't rigged, I'd like to hear your thoughts. Do you think the NFL is more rigged than I'm making it seem? And this would be a great opportunity to make more money. Or do you think they're just trying to capitalize on what's there and allowing the games to play out? I'd like to hear your thoughts down below. It would also mean a ton to me if you liked and subscribed. And as always, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.